I just wanted to hop on here today and show you how you can get more Google reviews on your Go High Level websites. Now, something as simple as adding this button right here, you see that if I scroll up or down, it stays right there. It doesn't take too much real estate and it even looks good on mobile. Something cool is when I hover my mouse, it becomes a little bit bigger. Let me show you very quickly in like five minutes how you can do this and start getting more reviews on your Go High Level websites. I'm going to go back to High Level. This is a template where I'm going to show you how to do it. So first we'll go to Edit. And we have to do two things. We have to add a button and then we also have to give it some styling. So let me just show you very quickly how that looks like. The first thing is we're going to add the button. So I'm going to do it all the way at the bottom. The reason why is I like to add it in my global footers just because if I make a change here, I will then see it reflected in every other single page. So I don't have to like manually add it here and then go to the other page and add it there and so on. What I'll do is I'll click this plus arrow right here select a code element click this one and now what i'm going to do is i'm going to open the code editor i'm going to be using my notion doc that has all of my go high level web design resources so if you're building websites on high level this is a resource that can help you do that it has taken me quite a while to compile and just based on different things that my different clients ask me so today we're going to be using this one right here how to add a floating google reviews button on a website so i'll click in there and right now we need this piece of code in step two. So I'm going to copy this, go back to high level, paste it here. What we're doing here is we're creating a button. And here there's two things that we can change. The first will be, of course, to add your actual Google business URL here. So in this case, let's say my business URL was this one right here. What I would do is I would copy the URL, go here and then replace this piece of code right here, or this URL, I should say, right here. The next thing that I'm gonna do is if I wanted to replace the image, I would replace it right here. What I've done for the Notion doc is I've added this image that you see on the screen right now. So if you wanna add a different image, you can do so. But for now, the current image would be this one right here. So let me just go back to high level. We'll click save. And then the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to give in some styling. So for that, we'll click on the custom CSS button. And then uh, on this window, if you haven't added any piece of custom CSS, this will be blank. So let me just open up some space for myself here. Go back to the Notion doc. And then we're going to copy this piece of code in step four. And let me just explain what this is very quickly. So I will paste it here. This first part right here is defining the positions to where in the screen it would be. And then here we're giving it some style. So we're giving like different style in terms of like the border, a shadow. We're also doing so that if a visitor hovers over the button, it will become 10% bigger or scale by 1.1%. We'll hit save. And now let's preview to see what that looks like. So now I'm here on the website. You see that it takes minimal space on the screen. In like five minutes, we were able to add this button right here. As I scroll down or up the screen, the button stays in position. It has like that nice shadow like around it. And when I hover my mouse, it becomes a little bit bigger, making it interactive. Also, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to click on the button. In this case, I get redirected to high levels, my business page, where I would just be able to leave a review. So this is how you're able to get more Google. Google reviews from your website, make sure that you're building your reputation and starting to rank higher on Google as well. If you're going to get a copy of my Notion doc, click the link in the description, get your own copy. It has like a bunch of resources, everything that I use on a daily basis to build better websites for my Go High Level clients. With that, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.